Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Kyle, also known as XCOD Crystal 2, and today we're going to do a little texture pack review with the pattern texture pack, and it just released on PS4 and Xbox One today. I'm not sure about last gen consoles um, and the PS Vita, of course, um, but you know, this texture pack, I, I just really wanted to make a review. I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm going to make a review or anything of the Mass Effect one because it's already been out on Xbox for quite a while. And you guys can pretty much figure what the Mass Effect one's going to be. So, uh, I just really wanted to uh, show this off because, you know, this is a new texture pack. This actually came out on PlayStation and Xbox One at the same time, which is quite surprising for 4J Studios. I actually kind of want to make a video about 4J Studios or something. But I had this little uh, just discussion I want to do. That's for a later time, a, little, a later video, though. Um, but today, we're going to do a little first impressions slash review. I, I, this is my first time loading this texture er, texture pack I'm just, just gonna explain my thoughts on it and should you guys buy it and stuff like that so texture packs normally I buy uh, this one I haven't bought yet I, I, I uh, excuse me I, I don't know why I'm burping I just ate something that's why but um you know, normally texture packs like they're only a dollar and texture packs are freaking are awesome uh, so that's why I bought this um yeah moving on though now this is a texture pack. Now this reminds me, just looking at the clouds, this reminds me of Spongebob right away. And I am on my subscriber world, it's crazy, it's like, it just, it's great to do a texture pack, kind of like review on this world. Uh, just to, uh, like, you know, fly around, show everything off, and this looks exactly like Spongebob, like the flowers in the sky sort of thing. Which is definitely really cool, it also kind of reminds me of the Sfax texture pack. And the inventory, wow, the inventory is quite weird. I did not expect it to look like that, actually. Um, but, you know, it's it's definitely just... It's a really cool and really different uh, type of texture pack. A pattern texture pack, which is definitely a really good idea. Um, especially, like, the grass and the, like, iron blocks and stuff. Where's the iron blocks? I know the iron blocks are somewhere. Not the iron blocks, but the block, of course, especially. looks like from the Spax texture pack right there. Like, they definitely based it off the Sfax texture pack, which is one of my favorite texture packs. So I had to just get, look at, look at the crosshair too. Crosshair is like perfect. It's like a perfect CSGO crosshair right there. But I'm just going to fly around a little bit. And, uh, you know, just look at this red right here. Like the patterns are just perfect for that certain color. This one I'm not too a fan of, but that still looks pretty cool. That green wool or something. Let's check out some of the skins. Now this skin, what's this? Oh yeah, this is, uh friend lightning gamer he actually made that skin which definitely looks really cool just like a bunch of uh different shades uh and everything like that which is pretty cool I like how the wood wood looks too it looks really nice and it, it just looks like it kind of this texture is kind of like cartoonish but it does look really really good too like i i like this kind of realistic slash cartoonish texture packs if that makes any sense um now here's my old skin back on the old i remember making this like it was crazy Flappy Birds are made out too. Pretty sweet. Definitely looks really cool though. Uh, look like the jacket. Actually, actually, that's really weird because I actually based this skin off of one of the jackets I was wearing that day. And this is the same pattern it had on it. It was like, it's really weird. So, Audio Studios, good job on this. They, they honestly did a really good job with this texture back. I'm just going to fly around a little bit more. Oh, is this like, oh yeah, X Cod Girl 22. Pretty awesome. I just really like how this design made by Cool Swag 12. Love the name, bro. That's pretty cool though. It's crazy. I remember I know who made this, Lee Crying Onion. Also known as that kid Mario. Definitely they made this curious George. It's awesome. Uh so I think this will wrap up the little texture pack review. You guys definitely should buy this or I I, I just think it's really cool. Like this is more of um I honestly think this is one of the best texture packs in the game, uh, to be honest with you, because it just uh, it's my personal preference, so I think this is one of one of the best. Uh, a couple reasons why. The crosshair is really nice. It doesn't get, isn't, isn't too big in the screen. It's just basic, you know, a couple lines and stuff. Uh, you know, it's just a basic crosshair. Oh my god, the movement looks pretty sw swiggity swag. Um, but, um, yeah, it's just definitely a really good texture pack. It just... I, don't, I just think it looks really, really good. It's simple. It's, you know, it reminds me of one of my favorite texture packs, Facts, especially this part, like the brick and everything. Oh my gosh. Um, but, but enough of that. I uh, hope you guys did enjoy. You guys can go pick this up for a dollar on the PlayStation Store or the Xbox Marketplace. Uh, I don't know. Again, I'm not sure if it's out for last gen and PS Vita and stuff. Uh, so they're probably going to have an update coming out soon. 
But uh, anyways, hope you guys did enjoy this video. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.